President Muhammad Buhari, while receiving the delegation of the Nigeria Liquidified Natural Gas Company, regretted the political squabbles and interference that in the past prevented the company from attaining its full potentials. His administration, he said, will fully support plans to expand the total production capacity of the company. The president promised that all bureaucratic bottlenecks created by multiple government agencies that currently impede the operations of companies in the oil and gas sector will be removed as part of the reforms to be undertaken. The managing director, Nigeria Liquefied Natural Gas Company, Mr. Babs Omotowa, requested President Buhari's support for trend seven of the company, which he said will create additional 18,000 construction jobs as well as an additional $3 billion dividend to government when operational. You may recall that the president, uh, when he was formerly the Minister for Petroleum, was part of those who uh, initiated the Nigeria LNG. So we've come to provide updates on the progress. We've built six trains and we've been able to uh, provide enough value for the country. At a meeting with the Exxon Mobil delegation, led by its managing director, Mr. Nolan O'Neill, President Buhari said his government will give priority attention to the security of oil and gas installations as well as maritime security in an effort to boost national earnings from the sector. He said the vandalism of oil installations and pipelines, piracy, oil theft and the fall in the international price of oil have made the nation's economic situation very disturbing and promised that everything will be done to secure the environment towards encouraging more investments in the oil and gas sector. From the State House, Adamu Sambo, NTA News.